Hey everyone, welcome back to Financial Future. I hope you're having a fantastic day so far. Today, we've got some exciting news for all Social Security beneficiaries. There's a substantial increase of $700, and some may even receive more. But in today's video, we'll be delving into when you can expect those first payments, where you'll see that increase. Also, is Joe Manchin finally making a move away from the Democratic Party? We'll cover an interview where he discusses that possibility, along with speculations about a 2024 presidential run. But before we dive into all that, if you could help me out by giving this video a like, it goes a long way in supporting the Financial Future channel. And of course, consider subscribing if you haven't already. Okay, let's get into the main content of today's video. Now, diving into the main story, the Senate has passed the government funding bill, averting a government shutdown. According to The Hill, Senate and House conservatives have pledged to avoid another omnibus spending package right before Christmas and New Year's. This two-step continuing resolution will fund government programs until January 19 and February 2. This ensures lawmakers won't face the usual end of your brinkmanship. They want to avoid the threat of a government shutdown right before the Christmas recess. In other news, Joe Manchin, a familiar name in recent times, has announced that he won't be running for re-election in the U.S. Senate in West Virginia. This has sparked speculation about whether he's leaving the Democratic Party. In a CNN interview with Caitlin Collins, Manchin expressed his independent stance, emphasizing that party labels shouldn't define individuals. There's also widespread speculation about him running for president in 2024 as a no-labels candidate. Let's take a look at a snippet from that interview. Feel free to share your thoughts on Joe Manchin in the comments section below. Now, on to the $700 increase for Social Security beneficiaries. Due to a 3.2% cost of living adjustment, some will receive even more than $700. The payment schedule for January 2024 shows the first payments on January 3 for those who started receiving Social Security before May 1997. Subsequent payments follow based on birthdays throughout the month. For the estimated average monthly Social Security benefits payable in January 2024, we see increases across various categories. For retired workers, the average benefit rises to $1997, up from $1848 in 2023. Couples receiving benefits will see an average increase to $3,330 from $2939. SSI beneficiaries and disability recipients also experience bumps in their average payments. Notably, SSI beneficiaries will receive their payments a bit earlier in December due to the holiday falling on January 1. They'll get their usual December 1 payment and a second payment with the 3.2% boost on the last Friday of December. That's all the news we have for today's video. I hope you found it informative and enjoyable. If you did, don't forget to give this video a like, consider subscribing to Financial Future, and I'll catch you in the next video.